Farfetch Reverse. I'll take it. Pokemon has finally done it and they printed a set specifically dedicated to the best generation ever made. JK. We all know that was generation three because it gave us Metagross and Salamence. Jokes aside, we do have Pokemon 151. We have one ETB and one binder collection. Binder collection comes with four packs and a binder. I thought that was pretty cool. And then the ETB comes with nine packs and some accessories that come in the box for TCG players. We will be trying to collect a master set and I'll say master set loosely. We're probably not gonna look for every reverse holo. We're just looking for one copy of each card, including SARs, special illustrations and whatnot. I hope you guys are doing well and I want you guys to know that you are loved. Let's see what we can find. First off, we're gonna start with the binder collection so we can, you know, put stuff in our binder as we go. Or maybe afterwards. Probably not as we go. That'll probably take up way too much time. Looks like it comes from side. There we are. We got our four packs of Pokemon 151. There we go. Excited to get into these. And then here's a moment of truth. I want this to be side loaders. I want this to be a side loading binder. Is it a side loading binder? Yeah, it is. It's the good type. So this will be good uh, to, you know, put your 151 cards into the binder. We have our four packs of 151 right here. Let's go ahead and get cracking. Let me know, guys, down in the comments, uh, what card are you looking for? Uh, we are looking for Blastoise, Venusaur, Charizard. We're looking for them all. There we go. Make sure it's nice. Ooh, there we go. Already starting off with the beautiful, beautiful Squirtle. Sorry, Radita. We got Squirtle right here. He's so beautiful. Then we got some Lickitung action. Gotta make sure I'm filming. If I'm not filming, that'd be, be bad. We got Venonat. And man, these cars look so great. We got Rapidash, Nidorina, Eradicate, Jolteon. I love this right now. Meowth. An Aerodactyl. Look at that Aerodactyl, man. Yeah, that was my... Uh... Yeah, we won't, we won't talk about that. Here we go. Pack number two. And we're going to kind of slow roll through some of these because... I oh, mean, this is exciting. Look. It's a snake. It's a slippery snake snake. Snake. I'm a snake. Cubone. Wow, and some of the a lot of these are going to be pretty decently playable as well. We got Volpix, and we'll go over the playable ones as we find them. We got Caterpie, Caterpie, Golbat. Look at that, a gap, a gape mouth. Bills transfer. Look at the top eight cards of your deck. You may re, you may reveal any number of Pokemon you find there and put them into your hand. Cool. We got Bills transfer. Not going to be too playable. We got leftovers. Leftovers is a really cool item card that you would use like, not a card, but like an item that you would use in the game that you would use so that, you know, you could regain some HP. So I like seeing that. We got Abra, Clefable, and Kabutops. That is a sweet Kabutops. A polite weakness for your opponent's active Pokemon as times four instead. Wow, look at that. That's a pretty sweet Kabut. Whoa, are these all like that? What in the what? Oh my goodness. Look at that swirl. Oh man. Oh goodness gracious. <laughs> These are beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'm going to sit here and just look at this guy all day. Holy smokes. <laughs> That is awesome. I love that hollow pattern. All right, let's get some more of those. Let's get some more. That's perfect because Charizard requires fire energy. And uh, that's a cool fire energy. Oh, my goodness. All right, here we go. Let's keep it fire like that. Let's keep it fire. We got Pony, Ponyta. Pikachu, look at him. Look at that little Pika. Oh, yeah. We got far fetched with his uh 
his plant. We got Muck. Daisy's help draw two cards. Look at your face down prize cards. Cool. It doesn't say shuffle them up. That's kind of cool. Actually, we got Venomoth. Farfetch'd Reverse. I'll take it. Woo! We got the Zapdos EX Special Illustration Rare out of the binder box. Holy moly. I love it. Look at that. We got Zapdos. We got Moltres. We got Articuno. This is hype. This is fire. What's a word? Wild. That's another word. That is so cool. Anyways, super awesome playable card as well in Miraidon. So now that I got you guys' attention, collectors, I mean, this is also a pretty playable card. Has the ability Voltic Float. If the Pokemon has any Lightning Energy attached, it has free retreat. So you can retreat for free. Very useful in the TCG with some free retreat. Then we got for three Lightning Energy, Multi-Shot Lightning. Hits 120 damage plus 90 damage to any Pokemon on your opponent's bench that has damage counters on there already. And you can pair this with Halucha from oh, was it? I can't remember what it was. Uh, Scarlet and Violet. You can pair that with that, and you know, start spreading some damage. And Maradon really needed some spread damage, but yeah, look how beautiful that is. We're gonna, hey, and we got the Alakazam EX. Oh, there we go. Look at that, baby. Alakazam is super cool too, because it has, you know, it has Mind Jack. This attack does thirty more damage for each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. 90 plus, but that is not the most interesting part about this card. The most interesting part about this card is that it has the dimensional hand attack for the first time ever. You're going to be able to attack from the bench. And you compare this with Klefki that has the uh, canceling ability. Uh, yeah, the canceling ability ability, the ability to cancel abilities in the active position. Just two psychic dimensional hand hits 120 to uh, your active Pokemon from the bench. But we're going to grab some Dragon Shield sleeves and, uh, you know, we're going to sleeve up these guys. Make sure they're nice and protected. All right, there we go. They are all protected. Now we'll go to the last pack. Are we, go are we going to be even able to, you know, top any of that? That's some, uh, that's some uh, pretty wild stuff right there. Another code. All right. We got Caterpie. Magnemite, look at that Magnemite. I love the art on these cards. Holy smokes, they look great. Eevee, that kind of reminds me of like a nostalgic looking Eevee with that watercolor. We got Antique Dome Fossil. Did we got something else in this pack? <laughs> we got Antique Dome Fossil. And this Pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks, but basically this is what evolves into Kabuto. Um, and it kind of has some ode to the game, some callback to the games. Where you got a dome fossil, and I believe you got what was the other fossil? I feel so dumb for not remembering, but we'll probably come across it. We got Polyrath. Look at that Polyrath. These are such nice looking cards. We got Pidgeot, Almanite, Pinsir, Monkey, and Ditto. This Ditto is really cool. Also, a pretty playable card. It has transformative start. Once during your first turn, if this Pokemon is in the active spot, you may search your deck and choose a basic Pokemon you find there, except any Ditto. If you do, discard this Pokemon and all attached cards and put the chosen Pokemon in its place, then shuffle your deck. So you can put this into your deck, and if you start with it, does it have to be in the active? Yeah, it has to be in the active. Um, but you can search your deck for a basic Pokemon and then just switch spots with it. And I believe you just put this into the uh, discard pile. Really cool card. Got to check for that hollow. No hollow. <laughs> Let's get started on the ETB. Boom. Forgot the pre-open it. All right, here we go. Comes with the booklet as all ETBs does. But since we are going for a big set, we're going to be able to use this to check off what we got and what we don't got. Anyways, here we go. Let's go ahead and get into this. We got some pretty cool sleeves. So we got some really cool sleeves that have I wonder if it's all 151. I don't think it's all 151, but it has some really cool uh, pattern with all those different colors. We got the code card right there. If you guys want that on the on the TCG Live, we got this sweet Snorlax promo that looks oh so good. Makes you feel like you need to go to sleep. 
which I feel like I need to go sleep because it is pretty stormy outside. We got a brick of energy. We got the dividers that look cool on both sides. I'm tired of these clear ones. We're not even gonna look at them. Then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packs. And uh, we're gonna have to go ahead and straight get it. Should I just shuffle them? Should I do the whole uh, the Cupid shuffle to the left, to the left? Here we go. Let's get into it. Let's party. All right. All right. Man. I can't believe we've already we already hit some big ones. We got Charmander. Charmander, this is the optimal Charmander if you play on um, playing a Charizard deck. Has the 70 HP. Really good. And also Blazing Destruction, discard a stadium in play. I mean, being able to discard a stadium in play is not bad at all. We got Spiro. Look at that art, man. Bell Sprout. Bell Sprout. Bell Sprout. Magic Carp. Carp. We got Scyther. Charmeleon. That's a pretty sweet looking Charmeleon, to be honest. I like that thing. We got Cloyster. Cloyster's always a uh, pretty cool Pokemon. We got Kakuna. Kakuna Matata. Flareon. And Gyarados. Probably the worst Gyarados ever printed. Because to evolve it, you have to uh, discard five cards off the top of your deck which is just absolutely absurd and it only does 200 damage all right here we go oh almost i almost just went straight for it we got lick a tongue a venonat pidgey this is also the optimal pidgey if you plan on playing pidgeot ex and your deck has the call for family attack so you can look for two basic pokemon and has 50 HP, which is better than the 40. We got Metapod. Metapod use Harden. We got Golduck. Nidorino. Pinsir. Erica's Invitation. Pretty cool card, especially if you plan on playing some type of control deck. Your opponent reveals their hand, and you put a basic Pokemon you find there onto your opponent's bench. If you put a Pokemon onto their bench in this way, switch it in that Pokemon into the active spot. So it kind of like... You can put a Lumineon in different style cards that, you know, kind of mess with your opponent to control your opponent. So Erica's Invitation is a pretty cool card. Behind the Erica's Invitation, we got Scyther again and Machamp. What does Machamp do? If this Pokemon would be knocked out by damage from attack, flip a coin. If heads, this Pokemon is knocked out and it's is is not knocked out and its remaining HP becomes 10 and then we have mountain chopping for 100 this card the top two cards of your opponent's deck see that's kind of a pretty cool card but this machamp looks sick i mean look at that that's a very clear cut machamp and i don't think we've had this clear of a cut machamp in a while i think that hollow pattern does some justice no hollow no hollow energy we're all about those holler energies now that galaxy that galaxy hollow I guess that they put in for those energies. Oh my goodness, they're beautiful. We got some Pikachu action. Poliwag, Farfetch'd. If you guys were to pull a hollow energy, which energy would you want to pull? We got Shelter. Ivysaur, look at that beautiful Ivysaur. Can we pull one of those God packs? We got Slowbro, where you can pull all the line. Oh my goodness, look at this Machoke. I mean, some of these cards look real nice. They look real nice. Marowak. Man, look at that. Look at those rocks. Working on something. Working on something there. We got Shelter. Mr. Mime. We have not pulled a double hollow yet, which is good. <laughs> if this Pokemon and your opponent's active Pokemon have the same amount of energy, prevent all damage done so to this Pokemon by attacks from your opponent's Pokemon. Cool. But not cool enough. We're going to go next pack. All 151 Pokemon in one set. No other Pokemon is in the set from any other generation. And I actually think that's just pretty cool. I think that's just unique. We got Staryu. Staryu. Uh, Charmander. Charmander. I like, I like being able to get that Charmander. Plan on building that... Uh, the Charizard EX deck, one of them anyways. 
Maybe I might play the Arceus version, might play the uh, Lost Box version, might play... Yeah, there we go. We got the War Turtle. Man, look at that. I love these cards. It actually looks really good in person. Now, the Blastoise one I was a little iffy about, you know? But I can't wait to see it in person and see if I actually, you know, in person, it, it's, it might, most of the time it looks so much better. But War Turtle looks so good. I like this War Turtle. And behind it, we got Raichu. When one of your Pokemon is knocked out by damage from an attack from your opponent's Pokemon, you may be, you may move one lightning energy from that Pokemon to this Pokemon. Not great, but we got a Psychic Hollow energy. Man, look at those swirls. They just like, they be just putting the swirls on. Look at that Pokeball right there. Holy smokes. Jeez Louise. It's going straight into a Lost Box deck since you don't have to have too many Psychic Energy. Man, these are beautiful. I mean, look at these cards. Let's get the Dragon Shield, Dragon Shield Perfect Fit sleeves. You hear that, Dragon Shield? We're using these because they're the best way to protect, best way to protect your cards. And I also love the way that they feel whenever you slot them into the binder. Next pack. Let's see if we can't get any SARs in these. We got all sorts of chances to get some more cards. Let's see if we can't get them. Ooh, look at that Geodude. Has a stiffen attack. Jigglypuff, Jiggly. Star you. Charmander, 70 HP, baby. Nitto Queen. Victory Bell. Where's James? You better run, James. We've got Big Air Balloon, the stage Pokemon. This this stage two Pokemon this card is attached to has no retreat cost. So that'd be good for your big stage twos if you play a lot of big stage twos. We got Fearow. Fear the Row. Scyther. <laughs> We got the Blastoise. Well, the full art Blastoise, but this is a good box here, man. We got War Turtle and Blastoise. No hollow energy. Man, look at these. Man, these are phenomenal. I love, I absolutely love uh, the, uh, the full arts in this set. I mean, those look so good. And Blastoise is my favorite starter Pokemon absolute favorite starter Pokemon oh man that looks phenomenal can't believe we pulled War Turtle and Blastoise that's pretty cool all right let's see if we can't pull uh Venusaur or maybe the Squirtle or maybe the the special is it the special illustration rare uh Blastoise how about we just pull that one that'd be cool we got Oddish did you guys know that Oddish won a uh, TCG World Championships. If you know, you know. You know. Meowth, Mankey, Execute, Parasect. Giovanni's Charisma is a pretty good card. Put an energy card attached to your opponent's active Pokemon into their hand. If you do, attach an energy card from your hand to your active Pokemon. So as you're taking away one of your energy attachments from your opponent's Pokemon, you're putting one back on yourself. So we got Giovanni's Char Charisma. Another kind of a control style. We got Rhydon. Pounding his way in the ground. Another Reverse Hollow Erica's Invitation. Shelter. And Flareon. Cool. We still have not pulled a double Hollow. I like that. And behind that. <laughs> there we go. Another Hollow. Man, these are absolutely stunning. I love these. Man, look at the swirls on this one. There's one, two, three, four. Let me know if I missed any. But those, these hollows are really nice. All right, guys, we got three packs left. Three packs left in this entire ETB. Now, it's possible that we can pull some Extreme fire out of these still. We got Drowsy. Bulbasaur, look at him. Just gazing up at the light. We got Dratini. Growlithe. Radicate. Man, these are such beautiful cards. 
I can't quit talking about him. Man, Magneton. First Magneton. Magneton looks really good. We got Marowak. Dragonite. Your Pokemon play have no retreat costs. Discard the top cards of your deck. Don't like that, but you hit for 180. And then behind Dragonite, we got Dodrio. Still not a double hollow, but we got Zooming Draw. Once during your turn, you may put one damage counter on this Pokemon if you do draw a card. And then it kind of goes with its attack, Ballistic Beak for one colorless energy. This attack does 30 more damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. So, I mean, this is a really good kind of like just a slow burn uh, setup card, especially good in GLC Gym Leader Challenge. Behind that, we got no hollow. Two more packs left, guys. What was your favorite part of the video so far? And if it's after I said this, you can change your mind. It's okay. It's all right to change your mind. We got Clefairy. Just enjoying it. Just enjoying that little that little branch right there. We got this beautiful Machop, man. The whole Machamp line absolutely looks good. They should have given um, Machamp another special illustration. Actually, they probably should have given every last evolution of every Pokemon a special illustration. I don't care if they've already gotten one in like in past sets they they should have done it in this set that would have been real cool we got kabuto gloom now everybody thought this gloom was going to be good as well as this entire uh what's it foul plume line when you play this pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your pokemon during your turn you may look at the top three cards of your deck and attach any number of basic energy cards that you find there to your pokemon in any way you like Shuffle the other cards back into your deck. So it's kind of like an electric generator um, in the Muradon deck where you look at the top five, attach any electric energy you find there onto your bench. And I believe this is to any Pokemon, but it's only top three. We got Clefable. Follow me, Clefable. We got Kingler. Nice. Giovanni's Charisma Reverse. And hey, a Golem EX. Although not playable, still a pretty cool, hefty, Pokemon looks nice. I really like uh, the look of all these. I think they did a great job. I even like this EX right here. Here, we'll dragon shield it later. No hollow. All right, one last pack, guys. One single last pack. Can we? Can we do it? Can we? Can we end this with a bang? With an absolute banger. Hope you guys enjoyed the video so far. I've had a great time enjoying Pokemon 151 for the first time. And uh, I've tried to look at no openings. I didn't want to look at nothing. I wanted to, you know, enjoy this for myself. And it's been pretty cool. This is a really fun set already. We got Rigid Band, the stage one Pokemon this card is attached to. Takes 30 less damage. Really good for GLC and Waylord. Eh, eh but also good for any stage one deck that's looking for some extra tank to it. Like, um, like Oink Alone. Oink Alone's going to love this card. I'm going to be so excited to play this with Oink Alone. We got Nidorino, Executor, Oddish, World Championship Oddish, Doduo, so no special illustration, but can we get something cool behind this Doduo? And behind the Doduo, we find a mine. No hollow. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you like Pokemon, check out this one as well. Other than that, always remember, stay thankful.